All right, so Saya, you don't want to be here for this part? You can go. He's very upset right now. And I'm so glad I got you. I love the things that we do. We, do. we a family together. Yeah. Beam squad, we gon' ride. Making the sun shine. But in time, we getting better. Ooh. Ain't even when you don't try. You making my heart smile. Yeah. Yeah. We really came from the bottom, and we going up. going up. I can never fall down, cause you hold me up. There's no place in this world that got all this love. Uh. What it is, Beam Squad? It's your boy Billy B, and today we are back with another. You already know what time it is. Banger, man. And I'm happy to say, you know what I'm saying? We're back, guys. You know, a lot of you guys have been in the comment section saying, Where's the wedding video? Listen, by the time you guys see this video, the video would already be out, but it. Some things happen, guys, and we have to get everything back in order with the editors and stuff like that. You know what I mean? But the video should be out by now. It's like one of the first, it's like the first vlog really back. You know what I mean? I'm a husband. Yeah, boys. Yeah, boys. I'm a husband. I'm officially a husband now. You know what I'm saying? It feels great. It feels great. I don't got the ring on right now because I just came back from the gym. It's kind of hard to work out with the gym, work out with it in the gym. So I didn't take it to me with the gym. So I don't want y'all to see me. I see my fingers going like this. I like where the ring at, Billy. You talking about all of your husband, but where the ring at? You know what I mean? But yeah, I'm a husband officially. You feel me? And it feels good. You know what I'm saying? I call, go ahead and go call my wife. Tell my wife how I feel, how I do. Everything is wifey now. Husband and wife type thing. We we on that type of time now. You feel me? We on that type of time, you know what I'm saying? It feels great. I get to go to the gym with my wife. See, I'm gonna keep saying that because it feels good to say, you know, my wife, you feel me? And it's just, just a great feeling, man. Let me see what everybody else doing. But, ooh, look at my girl. What's up, girl? What's up? Look at my house. How you house. feeling today? Fine. How you, how you feeling? Daddy. Hey, bro, what you like it, bro? Daddy. What you working around Daddy. Me? Where you going? Yeah. Where you going, bro? <laughs> guys the energy in the house has been so like so like everything's just been elevated after the wedding like the energy that we got from everybody and everything was amazing guys it feels so great it feels so great let me see what my wife is doing here i'm disciplining our son oh okay he's being bad he's not being bad he's just being disrespectful disrespectful i know mm. that's bad but so what's going on? Tell us the story. What happened? All right. So basically, my sweet nanny told. Hold on. Sire, before you start, baby, you're so beautiful. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. My wife. All right. So Sire, you don't want to be here for this part. You can go. He's very upset right now. He'll be back. If he act right, maybe I'll change my mind about the decision that I made. The grown up asked the kid, "Fix your bed." My other two kids, they fixed their bed. So my nanny was like, "Yo, Sire, fix your bed too." He has a bad habit of being like, "No." Like that's his like first instinct to say no. He does it to me too, and I really don't like it. So I told him not to do that to Tia. Well, Tia, she she came to me and told me, hey, I told her I'd clean, I mean fix his bed, and he told me no. I was like, hmm. Usually in my head, I'm like, usually he'd be playing when he do that. I asked her, I said, did he actually fix the bed though? She said no. I was like, okay. So I said, Sire, Tia told you to do that. Why you didn't go fix your bed? He didn't say nothing. I said, go fix your bed. He was zoned out. You know, zoning out is a superpower, right? Mm -hmm. It's something. It's a power that you can you you use to ignore everything around you and just go in inward in your in your brain. So that's what he did. So he's staring at me, and I'm like, "Go fix the bed." He ain't move. I'm like, "Jit, go fix the bed." He ain't move again. I said, "No video games for me." Then he want to get up quick and go. Oh, mom, I'm sorry, I was zoned out. That's a superpower, bro. I, I used to use it when I was a kid. So therefore, now he got a week of no gaming. And I don't like to do that to him. I don't like really punishing kids or doing that, but you know, you got to because then they think they're gonna run over you. So that's where I'm at today, you know? Punishing kids early this morning. Um, how was your workout today? You feel me? <laughs> that was amazing, because you check me out. Guys, I'm proud of myself. I'm thankful because I have a man like Billy to like tell me, baby, you don't need to do no crazy surgeries, you know? Let's go in the gym. And he been telling me let's go in the gym since after I had major. Actually, since after Messiah. You've been trying to get me to be consistent in the gym. Mm -hmm. And I, I'm up and down, you know. It's life. I got kids and stuff. But now, look at this. My my clothes are getting smaller. My Body stomach is just... Snatched. 
I'm so proud of myself, mm-hmm. y'all. Y'all don't even understand. I'm proud of you too, baby. I can even do. Look, look, y'all. I used to, I used to cannot do one push up. Look at me now. What? You know I'm not gonna push it no more. You know I get four. That's a lot for me. That's good. Is this a version of timeout? Okay, look. This is what I wanted to ask you. I wanted to put you in this program for the summer. Here, I'm, I'm actually not asking. I'm, I just don't know if this is something he'll be interested in. This is called cooking recipe to cooking. It's a cooking class. Four weeks. You wanna go? You can learn how to cook, bro. Then you could you could be a chef. Yeah. Then you could make us dinners. dinners. <laughs> then you could make us lunch. Then you can make us all type of stuff. Then and like, the then, then you can be like, yo, mom and dad, look what I made. Uh-huh. Taste this. Tell me if it tastes good. Ooh. And then it'll be like, ooh, ooh, that tastes so good, bruh. So, Sire, yeah, you're going to join a cooking program, okay? No. So, we, you see, you see, y'all heard him, right? He said it. He said the no. my opinion. I want to do editing. Yeah, I got you. Your shirt's dirty. You could, you could edit your shirt being cleaned up. So guys, I got food to cook today, dinner to cook and stuff like that. So let's get started with the day. Don't forget to do what y'all already know we like. Y'all do subscribe, like, and do all that good stuff. You can't hit the intro yet. I didn't even see how you. Oh, sorry. What's up, noobs? It's your boy, Super Saiya, and today I am angry. Yeah. I'm hungry. Ain't my food ready yet? Let's go see if your food ready yet. Why do you keep walking on with these sheets? It's freezing in this house. It's negative 30 degrees, guys. That's a lie. Put the sheet somewhere else. They don't belong in the kitchen. Help. Send help. I'm raising a 10-year-old. And y'all already know how that go. I got a couple things I need to do, too, this week. I got to take this car. You guys can see I got a Porsche now, right? After the Bentley, I decided to get it. I, 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 was, I, wasn't, I was unsure. I had got a Benz. And then what well, happened to the Benz, I had an S-Class. Um, I was driving in Miami. In Doral area, and I, I got flooded in. So the car I got, I went to a ditch where water. I don't know. I didn't record that. That was like back in September or October. And I waited a couple months before I got this bad boy right here. I'm in love with it, but now it needs oil change. And mind you, this one needs an oil change. That one needs an oil change. And the Aston Martin needs an oil change. And new tires right but we're selling that car so it's at the dealer so i don't really have to do too much to it right now i would have to take that one i always take it to the dealer because it's not not too far what is kind of far but Please i actually like message. going for that little drive and it's towards the beach so that way when they're doing their the maintenance on that i can just drive to i can I'm walk to the beach and then they handle this so that's that's the goal for right now um the aston martin for the aston martin we're we're in the works of selling it probably trading it in to get something else where i really want i want another s class um that's another car i really want that could be like a luxury family car type of thing and we could all fit in it other than that yeah that's really it so guys saya is down for the count i just signed my baby up for cooking classes for this summer so y'all stay tuned because me and Saya gonna have cook um, little cooking competitions because i'm the chef in this house in real life I didn't learn from nobody, but, well, I learned from my mom. And you know what's actually been getting on my nerves? I've been cooking and Billy hasn't been eating my food. He says his wisdom too has been hurting. I don't know, let me see if that's the issue for him. Why you don't be eating my food all the time no more? What are you talking about? Lately, you haven't been eating all my food. Like, you just, you don't eat everything I cook. What's what going food on? are you talking about? The co- food I cook, like I cook the white rice and chicken. I ate the chicken yesterday and the broccoli. For real? Yes. What about the rice? I didn't eat the rice. I'm I'm slowing down on the rice. Oh, I thought And so. then also my tooth been hurting. Oh, how that's going? It hurts. Why? You know, you you told me it was like this area was swollen. And I was like, yes, last night this was swollen. This side been this side has been my wisdom tooth on this side has been hurting for about two months now. Two months? Two months now. The tooth part is it's, I'm starting to feel it again. Mm-hmm. This tooth is starting to push again. I feel this side now. Mm-hmm. This side, what's going on is the gum is is like, irritating. it's like irritating. It's like it's like it's swollen. Mm-hmm. So it's like the top tooth mm-hmm. is, and this is, this is the gum, and the bottom tooth is kind of like touching it like this. Mm-hmm. So it gets every time I eat, I can't eat on this side. I have to eat on this side. But now it's sound now that now that this side is hurting, it's like it's hard to eat. I rather drink smoothies and stuff. 
Dang, so what you want Or I do? eat, like when I eat wings, I eat it like this, or I'm eating soft foods, so, like salmon, So you're gonna fish. pull it out? I'm, I'm scared. Listen, I never been, I never did nothing like that. You never did nothing like putting this. Like out? I never did any type of surgery. I read this a long time ago that when you have a wisdom teeth, the pain from a wisdom teeth gives you wisdom. Cause I Googled it, I was like, why do they call it a wisdom teeth? Like, how's it wisdom? But apparently that's what happens. You you're, 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 you gain some type of wisdom when going through that type of pain. Yeah, it hurts. I've, I've been doing going through it for a while. So when are you going to go get your teeth fixed? I have an appointment on tomorrow. Oh, so you're going to be under anesthetics and stuff like that? I don't know if it's going to be. They're just going to check it to see. And then if I... If I if you need if, it? If I need... Nah, most likely I need it. But yeah. I guess they just want to see exactly where it's at and everything. And then from then... It's hard to talk. Good. Um, I'm sorry to you because I just remembered how the anesthetics feel. And me, I, I get deep cleanings. Like I have real, I get the deep ones. So they have to put anesthetics in my, like they numb my mouth so that way they could clean deeply into my teeth. That alone hurts. I'm sorry for anybody who had to go through this, but y'all, I will keep y'all posted on Billy's teeth, um, his wisdom tooth teeth situation. Let me situation. know if you guys have done it before and how was it? Was the like the after it's, effects? We could even Google. Um, yeah, we could Google. We could YouTube. I, you know, Google, you know, Google be fake sometimes. I'd rather hear from them because uh -huh. they could keep it real. You, you right. know what keep I'm it real in the comment section. Don't give us no fake stuff. Tell yeah, us real what happened. Let me know because I'm over here scared. Like, scared. Later that same evening. Quick run of this, but let me tell y'all something. I'm having the hardest time with major skin. It's like the worst issue for me. So I took all the kids off of the babies off of um, the, um, the protein shake because especially major, he didn't need it. And I was tired of giving them milk every night, right? So uh, Melly started losing weight. She's vegan. She doesn't eat any meat at all, but she eats everything else. So we gave her protein shake again and major wants it so i give major a little bit but i realized the difference i noticed that when i took major off of the protein milk whatever that his skin was so good it was not as bad but now that i put him back on his legs are the worst the eczema flare-up is so bad and now i gotta take him off the milk again and he's so sad because he loves it and now i don't know what to do well i knew i do know what to do. The, i gotta take him off the milk that's just it is what it is he can't have it but melly is my problem i wish I wish she would eat meat, but it's like she a natural vegetarian, and I just want to let her be great because it's actually good to be vegetarian. I'm honestly thinking if the whole family should adopt this type of eating habit, because y'all remember we used to be pescatarian, but we switched it up when I got pregnant with Major, and Major just wanted nothing but meat. Like I, I literally had cravings for chicken the whole time I was pregnant with Major. I used to hide from Billy and sneak to like Chick Fil A to get chicken, <laughs> and now we all adopted this chicken lifestyle. But except Melly, I feel like after the wedding, um, it was like a moment of finally free for us. Like finally, like we got to celebrate everything after all that we've been through, right? And now it's like, what's next for us? What's next is taking care of the fam and putting the kids in programs and just doing the best we can for our children, right? So health is important. And I'm thinking about going vegan. I don't know y'all, I might give up chicken. I'm gonna see a Billy down for the count if you wanna do it with me. I'm even thinking of growing my own, like having a little garden going on. I see my friend Keisha, she do a little gardening and stuff. And I see a lot of people do gardening. I'm, I wanna do it too, cause it looks very feminine. It's giving soft, it's giving feed your family your own organic foods. It's giving you control what you eat. I like that, you know? So, I don't know, I might consider it y'all. Y'all, the, the, the robots and the AIs is gonna take all these jobs and I feel so bad cause look at all of this. This is all like self-checkout, which is cool. I like it. <laughs> I like it and stuff, but I feel bad for the workers because they ain't going to have no jobs and soon the AI is going to be answering questions for us. Like we'll be able to pull up to the register or we'll pull up to like a little computer, ask the AI which aisle the candy in and the AI finna tell us. So no jobs for lots of people. That sucks. But times are changing. So everybody need to go virtual, get some virtual type of investments get some virtual type of businesses and like change with time because time don't stay still buddy even y'all even y'all in the future me and billy do plan on doing some finance things because y'all y'all know we've been trading um forex for a long time i stopped because i have a love for youtube that is just too strong and billy's really into that and i think it's gonna benefit a lot to y'all to learn how to do things virtually and how to get money virtually you know 
but babe what if the internet just fall off like what if the internet just crash that would be bad that would be like catastrophic then the ai's and all that stuff that would be non-existent we're gonna do something for y'all real soon because i know a lot of y'all been asking us to mentor forever and even though we don't know what it how it would look like but i think we got something in that type of field of teaching y'all what to do billy especially right babe yeah yeah so we're gonna just, see just comment down below what you guys want from us to teach let me pretend i'm a know. subscriber babe yeah. i already know Hold on. i already know but teachers, I, just, I just want them to like see that they want to know about how to start a youtube channel but yeah stuff they, like that i know um, they want to know how to start a youtube channel how you trade forex mm -hmm. they want to do um they probably want to know i think that's about it yeah. but what else you thinking they want to know like every, i think there's more all right so yeah Something so like comment in the comment like section this. so now we're going back home i got the eggs i have forgot them because we just left the uh, Publix. but i got the eggs and I'm gonna make Sai's favorite dinner today only because don't think I'm a soft mom now because they probably like hold on how, ain't, he on, on, ain't he on punishment like why he get his favorite break, um, dinner only because this morning I asked Sai to make the kids breakfast for me which is literally just waffles but just make it for me and I'll make his favorite dinner it was a deal so guys we came back from the um, grocery store and we got stuck here watching I do it we got stuck here watching so you were Carmen, Carmen. You, you cheating Oh, so she cheated. That's that's your excuse. Oh, I mean, I'm like, just so bothered because I cheated. She cheated. I, I, I cheated. I didn't fuck nobody. Oh, but you cheated. Well, how know. did I cheat? It? All right, so you want to go there? Like, Come on, all right, all right. But why did I cheat it though? I'm what Carmen cheated? What Carmen cheated? cheated? What Carmen cheated, kid? What Carmen cheated though? Did, though? You, why though? What she did? Tell them. Tell the people what she did. You tried to give me a reason why she did. Hold on, let's go. This is interesting. It's like soap opera right now. My tooth is hurting, and look at this guy. All right, guys. Um, we're done watching it. Let me know in the comment section if y'all watched that that video, and if y'all did, I don't know. Yeah. It's not. It's not really to be watched. To be honest, it was just them arguing. Yeah. But they ain't really getting. They hurt. They, they hurt. They both hurt. They both are hurt right now. You could tell. Remember what our therapist taught us? Like when when the the volume, if you triggered up to here, anything that's is being said to you is gonna trigger you even more. So that wasn't the right time for them to have this little public conversation. Yeah. But we I need to redo that over. I know. And be all on a calmer state. But, but she, he said she cheated. He said she cheated. And she said she didn't have sex. But do you, do you feel like che cheating is cheating if you didn't greet somebody? <sighs> cheating is still cheating, right? You know, everybody has an end date, right? Everybody's relationship has an end date, and it's, it's really important to know when it is, when it's time to call it quits. It might give it. They might get back together too. You never know if the love is strong. Yeah, they might get back together. You know, right now they're just mad at each other. They just gotta analyze what they what they've been going through, and, and then like, you know, if it's if it's if it is the end, it's the end. But I feel like they can work on that. Yeah. They've been together for a long time, so it's this is probably like one of those um, states that they're um, they got turbulent get. states that they're in right now, mm -hmm. and you know. They just gotta it get might through feel it. like they just gotta get through it, and then that's it, and make adjustments. Mm -hmm. He gotta hear her out, she gotta hear him out. And some and, woman, and you both have to grow. Uh, like if you if you're not willing to grow, then there's there's no point. Then and then their egos, like they both got their egos up to here, and their mm -hmm. lifestyle. I know, I no no disrespect. I hope she don't watch this and think I'm disrespecting any of them, both of them. But the lifestyle you live plays a part of how your relationship is if you guys clubbing every day i got all all these different doms shaking ass and doing all this stuff you bound to be, go through this yeah, right here because it's too much it's too much you got too much um too much what's the word babe too much temptation is around mm -hmm. you know for for him for her for both of them so it's like come on man that ain't smart y'all marry people y'all shouldn't be doing all that rah rah stuff that's single people stuff they be doing a lot of single people activities yeah where the kids be at when they do that I don't know. they be in miami turned up no disrespect not even trying to say that i'm just saying like what happened like where, where the kids be at that's i'll be true. feeling like when you get married and you got kids that's time for you to like you got to really start realizing like now our you life gotta understand they still young so right that's why some people don't that's why they don't be people i had saw something that they, a man said people do need to get married young because it teaches them how to be committed it teaches them to go through this phase versus being single through your 20s when all you're doing is humping girls humping girls and expect to get married later on because you're not used to 
being committed so mm-hmm. maybe that i don't know it's just i guess everybody got their own differences like people just got to go through things and wing it out but their situation i feel bad for them and i hope they fix it because they look nice together and they got beautiful kids yeah kids need both parents in their lives so i hope they figure that out yeah so we're gonna say bye-bye to the porsche yeah for now Babe, you see that iguana? Why it's so massive? Ooh, it's so massive. Y'all can't see it though. It's not that big. It is kind of big. It's like the ones, it looks like the ones you caught, the dragon that was in our um, garage. You guys, I mean, not in our garage. If they're you guys didn't watch the dragons that was in our pool, they're go look dragons. at the video. They're not dragons. Sorry, they were dragons. They were in that video where I said they were, I can't believe these monsters were living in our pool. They no, were big, just like that dragons. iguana. Let me see, Sire. Let's see if you can see. Come on, Sire. You guys see it? It's right there. I don't think they're fast. It's looking at me like you think I'm going to pee. Ah, it ran! It ran! They run so cringe. Look at how big it is. They are on four. Ooh, we run fast. They run on all four. So, so I don't throw nothing at it. I just want to see how big the dragon is. Wow. You guys are witnessing a big dragon going into the lagoon. Look at it go into the lagoon. It probably can swim too. Wait, wait. Got it. Wait, 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 wait. Got it, got it, got it. It can swim. Look at it. It's right there, guys. Let's see if it actually goes. They're looking at me. You are right. It is a dragon. Some people call it dragon lizard. Dragon lizard. Yeah. Let's see if you can go in there, buddy. Sorry, go see if it's going to go actually go in the. Oh, look. Don't throw nothing at it. That's mean. Well, Don't get too close now. It's so vibrant and green. I know it can go in the water. I want to see if it's going to jump. All right, guys. Well, we are going to we enter the, the lagoon, boat? and we're going to see if the dragon will enter the lagoon as well. I do not want to get injured. Do not try this at home. Ah! It got into the lagoon! It swam like an alligator! Oh, my God! Oh, my God! You guys, it swims like an alligator yeah, the way it just jumped just in there. Down, it starts charging at us. I know, right? Bro, I would run. Who do you think would win the race? So how long do you think it's going to stay down there? I think like maybe five minutes. You think it could bleed down there? Yeah. Yeah, they was down in our pool for a long time when they was in our pool. So, wow. Bro, that thing is small compared to the biggest. The biggest? I ain't never seen nothing bigger than that. Let's go check the... All right. Let's go check. All right, let's go see what that got okay, going go, on. Let's go see what that got going on with the Porsche. Bye, Porsche! No! Bye, Porsche! No! Oh my God! You're going forever! You didn't run after your own car, bro. Why are we even wasting our energy? All right, y'all, I'm hungry. Let me show y'all what I got going on for today. What are we in for lunch? There's not no dragon in the pool. You're lying, Sire. There's nothing in there. I know. Oh. Huh? I'm about to make something. I'm Here. hungry too. I feel like I'm about to pass outside. What happened? Why, why I got hungry out of nowhere? Because we, 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 we was working outside. You don't know what we feel like. You just be home chilling. We even made him come to the gym with us. Oh, no. First of all, you're wrong. Bro, you don't even know how to do a push up. Do one. I can do five. Let me see. Okay. Can do don't mind our trash right there. All the way down. Okay. One. one. Yes, you can. Two. Two. Three. Yes, he can. Four. No, that last one, you oh, cheated. No, he did, he did. High he cheated. Don't hurt your stomach. Come here. Look, look, look. Trying to be a mom. I'm not trying to be a mom. Trying to be a mom. Look, look, look. That's like, oh, my son. Babe, listen. Listen to him. Stop roasting. Your toes, your toes need to be in a better position. They was doing crib walk. Yeah, there was crib walking. They was like this. walking. Let me see them crib walking toes. I'm so happy my mom is making my favorite food. And to be honest, Mm -hmm. I did need a break of the games. You need a what? A week break of the games. You did need a break from the games? Yes. So you're happy that I gave you a little punishment? Uh Uh-huh, because now I'm having so much fun with you guys. Yes. See how much fun you have. Family time is better. Family time is Looking at the screen 24 seven. Hey, okay, so, uh, hey guys, tip, stop playing games, you know. A tip from Super Saiyan. When he said playing playing Fortnite all day, he didn't. I didn't mean it. He didn't mean it. I quit Fortnite a long time ago. Yep, he did. I actually miss Fortnite, y'all. They came out with a um, new season. I want to go play, but... It's, they got Transformers in that. I think like some kind of dinosaur. Y'all, comment in the comment section if you guys seen the new Fortnite um, event that we didn't get to see. I don't think there was an event, though. Oh, okay. Ooh, my chicken done. I'm eating the chicken. Y'all might not be in it, but I'm eating it. That chicken funny. Watch out, Jet. That chicken gonna go. Hey! Yeah. 
Mm. It was good. I'm gonna eat with some white rice. Call it a day. Yeah. What you looking at my chicken for, bro? I thought you said you ate it yesterday, the day before, and all I that. I did. So what you looking I'm at? I'm going for you. You said you can make lunch. Yeah, but I gotta eat first. I'm starving. Okay, go eat. Okay, then you look like a sad puppy. Yes, mm. So, my mom didn't stop, didn't stop the recording. I want to keep recording, and I wanted to tell you guys something. Just another reminder. Follow my two accounts. You see, I have two now. Um, Bonk. So the one that I already told you guys about, uh, Saya.psp, and then I have another one that's Saya.vfvfx, and I want you guys to follow it. Stop playing games, guys. Meanwhile. Oh, it's really gloves, bro. Can you put me some gloves? All right, y'all, so Brussels sprouts, right? Simple stuff. You just put like salt and pepper, right? But I don't do all that salt and pepper stuff. I like this avocado seasoning because it got a lot of stuff in it, like a different, yeah, it got different stuff. But you, the Brussels taste good on its own. Once the Brussels cook, you put hoisin sauce on that thing and it's, it's done. It's so easy for this to cook, you just put it in the oven. I almost forgot oil. I told you I'm making his favorite meal today. So we eating fried, and we don't usually eat fried no more. All right, see this? Back up. Oh, hey, hold on, watch out. I know what happened. Ooh, that looks oh, wait, nice. Wait, wait. The bottom. Mm -hmm. I should have done it. All right. Ooh, if that thing that was on looking nice. good, boy. If that thing was on, oh, that really smelled good. Ooh, look at that, look at that. Yeah, feel me, your girl. Even as I told you, I be chefing up, but I don't know how to teach kids, so I don't think I'm gonna be able to teach size, so he's definitely going to cooking camp. And that's, we gonna have two chefs in the building. Mm -hmm. The best life. Wow. Sure. Check me out, you already know, with the nice crunchy salmon. I got my Brussels in here. Look at them. Could you see? They nice. I got the, I already put the hoisin sauce on it. Remember guys, hoisin sauce. This right here makes the Brussels fire. It's later on the day, y'all. As you can see, it's really, literally nighttime. Look at my babies. My baby woke up from their long look, nap. Look, 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 look at this. What, what, what you showing us? Ooh, look at my baby's trick. Ooh, go Matty. Ooh, yeah, now Major gonna cry. Okay, Major, you know you can do it too. All right, all right. You like my hair? Yes, we like your hair. Let me see. Comment in the comment section down below if y'all like Melly's hair. Turn around, show them. Model, mate, Melly. Melly, model for us. Walk down this runway, model. Good job, now spin around, do a spin. Spin, ooh, yes, girl. Do a spin again? Yeah, and then look at that side, let me see your walk. Oh, 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 boy, what is that? <laughs> now, what, 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 what is going on, Major? What are you doing? Hmm. No, no more vitamins, <laughs> bruh. No, Papa, you had enough for the day. I want a blue one. Um, no, mommy, you had enough. Mommy, look, you go, mommy, go, cutting back up. Mommy, cutting back up. Let's go upstairs, guys. All right, so we're here in you guys' play area. Yeah, yeah, vibing. And look, and look, what you and, and look, you put, look, 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 you put in here. Look, 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 Thing. Oh, you want what? What's gonna come out of it though? It's Water? gonna come out and pop. Then they're gonna. You need to buy play off that. We don't. We need to buy play off first. I'm gonna play though. Okay. Okay. Not today though. Uh, you wanna do tea time? Give me a cup. Let me get some juice. Give me juice. No, no juice in it. Oh, you don't wanna share? Okay. I don't wanna spoil my kids, y'all. I don't wanna give them too much, too many toys because I feel like they have. Yeah, y'all presents coming on your birthday and stuff like that. I got major some stuff because I feel like he was lacking. Um some toys in this little kid's area so I got him some Hot Wheels but I don't want my kids to be overly spoiled to have too much stuff and always consuming I don't want them to be the type of kids that's always buying 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 and never have enough so that's why I'm not buying nothing else hold on my baby wants to talk to y'all what's up I don't have pink cars. You do have a pink cars right downstairs. Where? It's downstairs, the no, big one. No, not the big one. No, I want to have small pink cars. Okay, I'll get you a small one so you can race with your brother, okay? Okay. Okay. Anyways, y'all, um, so Billy is in the room. He's not feeling good. He took some pills, but his teeth is still hurting him. And I'm going to go take care of him. 
I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Don't forget to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, Do hit that little bell. Do Hold on, okay, bye. We really came from the bottom and we going up.